Oh my god, did you just love that opening? <laughs> I love that song. I, I think that's a very cool song. So anyway, guys, welcome to finally, oh my god, finally, Let's Play Tales of Destiny Remake Director's Cut Leon Side. Oh man, I miss doing this so much. And this time we're actually going to be doing, you know, an actual console game, not on the computer, like, you know, emulators and stuff. That's, oh... I am so excited, guys, and thank you for every, for, like, the, I mean, I don't care what kind of support, I mean, I may got a little support, but I'm, th I'm, thank you for anybody who's watching this, um, hopefully you guys are gonna enjoy this project, I know I'm gonna enjoy it, because this is one of the funnest RPG games that I played, um, so, yeah, <laughs> let's just start it, um, let's see, new game, or load, or, no, 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 no load, load game, new game, I mean, so, yeah, um, I'm gonna be doing Leon side, because, because this is gonna be my first walk. Well, not my first walkthrough. I did Tales of Fantasia and Destiny, but I kind of stopped that. But, but since I, this is gonna be like my first thing with the dazzle and everything, I'm gonna do Leon side because it's kind of short and it covers my well the first part of the game, which is actually one of my favorite parts. <laughs> I mean, I like the second half and the third. I'm not like the second half, but. I just like the first half because, like, the bosses are a little bit interesting, to me at least. I mean, I'm not saying the second half is bad, it's awesome, but it's, it's just that the, I, th I guess the biggest downfall is the dungeons get really, really complicated, or like, uh, not complicated, but annoying. So, yeah. um, <laughs> so basically, the Leon side is just um the main game, where, but in Leon's perspective. So we get to see like his story, but well, yeah, Leon side. But um, unfortunately, it's in Japanese. Yeah, this game is a Japanese. It is. I mean, this game is Japanese, so we won't understand shit. <laughs> so if you guys don't mind, I'm gonna be skipping the dialogue like this. So I mean, like some of you guys who like play who are like hardcore Tales game gamers or something like that I'm, are gonna probably hate me for this, but it's just to save some time. Cause I mean, like most, of, I'm assuming most of you guys do not understand what the hell they're saying. Um, I would really like to know. I, I mean, like I would really like to know, what, um, or at least understand what's going on. But I only understand stance. So I don't really understand like what's what's the deal with Leon. Like what it, what are his thoughts about things? I don't know, it's just basic- I I'm assuming it's just basically- I have trust issues, ugh! And we basically go around the world, Dora the Explorer style. <laughs> you know, like, oh, it's pointing out the fucking obvious on everything. <laughs> uh, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna skip this. Um... So, how am I- so, I'm gonna- let's see, the way I'm gonna be doing this is- um, because I'm gonna be doing- I'm gonna do this solo. And, uh, oh, wait a minute. OH SHIT! I just realized! Oh! Wow, what a way to start a walkthrough, guys. Oh my god, just like the original Tales of Destiny that I had, but it was with the bullshit name part. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm not supposed to put new game, I'm supposed to put continue. Urgh. <laughs> wow, I, I, I'm stupid. Okay, so basically, I'm gonna do the new game option. I didn't, I, I didn't, the new game plus option, not the new game option. Wait, what? Oh my god, oh, oh, wait, I did it wrong again. Holy fuck. I'm sorry, guys, I'm totally screwing this up. Um, okay, press triangle to actually start new game plus. Okay. Yeah, that's how you do it. Then you can choose which side you want to do it, regardless of which side you started with that other file. So basically, with New Game Plus, you inherit all your Narakiri dolls, which I will explain that later in a bit. All your collect, all your battle books, like collector's book, um, discovery book and shit. And I think s some of your arts. Oh, not all your art, your art count usages. So, hold on, let me just 
delete everything. Okay, so basically, this is the grade shop. How the, the way the grade shop works is every time you clear a game, you get one grade point. But every if but if you defeat the final boss and a harder difficulty settings, for like example, let's say you defeated the final boss on normal, you only get one grade point, I think. But if you defeat it on hard, you get two. So and so on and so forth. The higher you set the difficulty setting when you fight the final boss, the more grade you'll get. So yeah, I got five grade, but that's because yeah, because um. This is my second playthrough file, so and I just challenged him on chaos, and I got a lot of grades for that. So, <laughs> or at least I only got five. So anyway, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be inheriting extend chain, which extends your chain capacity. Um, also infinity movement, uh, which basically all your like backstepping, double jumping does not does not um expend as CC. Um. Low gravity just makes aerial comboing a little bit easier. And solo mode, yes, this is what I want to do. Um, solo mode, which basically means that the character on the first slot is always going to be by himself in battle. So that's going to be kind of, oh, <laughs> it's going to be kind of weird. Um, and succeed skill, which inherits all arts. So I think that's it. That's all I'm going to be doing. I only have five. So, yeah. Oh, I can't believe I have to do this shit over again. Yeah, just skip it. We already seen this. Leon's side again. <laughs> oh, how many minutes? Oh, oh shit! Eight minutes, and I haven't even started the freaking game. Mario. Oh well, I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing like 15 minute videos, so I'm just gonna skip this because we already seen this. We already seen Marion and Leon, whatever the fuck they're talking about. And then some soldier comes here. And I don't know, guys. The king summoned us or something. Okay, shut up! So again, I apologize for anybody who actually likes to hear Japanese voices, but... I mean, I, I kind of like to hear that too, but only in battles. I mean, I don't like to hear them when they're, like, speaking, because... Like, story dialogue, because... I mean, I get... I mean, not that I don't like to hear them, and they're interesting, it's just that... Uh, it's just... If you don't understand it, it just feels like... It just, it just gets boring, so... Whatever, I'm not, I'm gonna stop I'm gonna stop apologizing about that. This is just the way I'm gonna be playing it. But I'm not gonna be doing it with um the English tells games. I'm not gonna be skipping the dialogue on there because of course I wanna be showing up showing the story off and I'm I'm sure that like a lot of people speak English, so <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Yeah, whatever. So yeah, Leon side. Yay! Um so all right, let me just explain a few things. How am I going to be doing this? Um, yeah. I'm going to be setting the random... This is the difficulty setting, by the way. And to actually access your options, there's not a, like an option in here. It's not on the menu. You press select button. Anyway, um, I'm going to be doing the random battles on evil mode. Yeah, we're going to be doing difficulty. Um, what did I just turn off? Oh, whatever. Um, I'm going to be doing the random battles on evil mode. But all the bosses, I'm gonna try to do it on chaos, just to like spice things up a bit. Um, and I kind of tried playing this game. I did like a little test run of doing it solo, just to make sure I can actually do it. And well, it it's gonna be a lot. There's gonna be a lot of game overs, and I'm gonna and this is gonna be a good practice for me to try to edit stuff out <laughs> because there's gonna be a lot of editing. I can foresee this happening already. So. Okay, let's just set up our, our, our arts. The, yeah, the first option in the menu is our arts. And as you can see, we can set it up just like in any Tails game on any directional buttons. So for the neutral, we're going to have um, Demon Fang, which is this one. Um, for the up, um, I'm going to have, I think it's this is Swallow Talon, which rapes aerial enemies. I hate aerial enemies in this game, even though it's more focused on aerial combat, but it's just, ugh, they're so annoying! Um... For the side, I'm gonna have Gennesian. This is such an awesome skill if, in order to start invading attacks. And for the down, I'm gonna have Dragon Swarm, Soryu Dengazan. Now, here's what I really is gonna make Leon's side, I mean, soloing with Leon really easy. Demon Lance Zero. Um, the way this spell works is, every time you cast it, you get like a penetrate effect, which um, is like a beneficial status effect that you won't stagger. The, uh, you won't, you won't be able to, you, the enemies won't stagger you until they hit you like five times or something like that. Um, it's a really good, useful skill, and the number of times they, they're allowed to 
Well, the number of times of that you're invincible, they get stacked up every time you use it. So that's really good. And uh, another spell. No, not really. I'm not going to put another spell. I'm just going to put um, Guess and Go. Or, yeah, that. Let's go. Um, well, 12 minutes. Uh, <laughs> I'm just checking the time. Um, here, this is equipment. As you can see, we have Swordians. But unlike Tales of Destiny, the original Tales of Destiny, um, we don't have Swordian discs. What we have is Swordian devices, device points. And as you can see, there's, well, there's overall six levels of skills, and this is kind of like the add skills from Tales of the Abyss, so that's kind of cool. Um, except you have to expend S SP? Is it SP? Yeah, SP, in order to um, equip these skills and master them. So, right now, I actually got like a little... I actually made like a little guidebook from all the information I acquired from GameFAQs and all over the internet or such stuff. It's kind of messy, but... I, I, I have it with me right now, and that's how I'm going to be playing it. Like, I have this all of this translated, because obviously I do not know Japanese. Um, so for this one, what they already got me equipped is attack, hit, exceed, and critical. Um, these two, they're mind and the earth. Um, the way I'm going to be doing this is I'm going to be listing all the important stuff in the video description, like equipment, um, or at least accessories, because, like, this, this, this stuff, yeah... Yeah, I mean, they're, they're kind of hard to find out, like, what they are in Japanese. <laughs> but, I'm going to list at least the accessories that I have equipped, the arts I have equipped, and the sword and device skills that I have equipped. So, yeah. So that way, if you guys are playing this game along with me, you can easily follow it. And, oh yeah, these this is the items menu. And so, we can check out, like, the items that we have. We have apple gels, peach gels, life bottles... And we have these weird material thingies, which I will explain that later. Um, and the new to tells to the tells games, we have um the food strap system, which is actually like the food sack system back in Tales of Destiny, the original Tales of Destiny. But it's a little bit better as you can actually equip different types of food recipes, and they'll activate in battle depending on the situation they have on the description. Um. I don't know if I'm going to be, like, listing that in the video description as well, but I don't know. We'll just see. Because that's it's kind of a hassle trying to put all that crap into the video description. You guys probably don't even want to care about that. Um, I'm not, at least I'm going to at least show it to you, like, what I have. But, uh, um, and here we have the refine menu, which lets us upgrade our equipment through lenses. Uh, yeah, lenses return, but unlike Tales of Destiny remit I mean, the original Tales of Destiny... You don't use lens just to sell items. You use them to upgrade your equipment. So that's... It makes them a little bit more useful. But... Yeah. <laughs> um, it's just a little bit of a... It's kind of a little bit tedious trying to... Like, do all that stuff. But, oh well, whatever. I'm, I'll, you'll get used to it. So, yeah, let's just search around for items and crap. Toilet! Oh, there's nothing in there. <laughs> um... Holy fuck, I'm past 50 minutes. Okay, um, I'm gonna stop the recording right here and I'm gonna start a new one. So, see you guys in a bit.